नमस्कार आई एम अमित कुमार वेलकम यू ऑल इन आई एम डीज डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग सो इफ यू लुक एट द ट्वेंटी फोर आवर्स रेनफॉल विच वॉज रिकॉर्डेड ये स्टडे फ्रॉम ये स्टडे टिल टूडे इज एट थर्टी ए एम देन हेयर यू कैन सी दैट ओवर तमिलनाडु एंड एस आई के वी हैव रिसीव्ड एक्सट्रीमली हैवी रेनफॉल एंड ओवर सम पार्ट्स ऑफ केरला कोंकण गोवा तेलंगाना छत्तीसगढ़ ईस्ट राजस्थान सौराष्ट्र उत्तराखंड एंड असम Meghalaya, we have received very heavy rainfall. If we see this graphic of top five stations in India which have recorded rainfall, then here you can see that in Tamil Nadu, in Nilgiri districts at Avalanche Station, 34 centimeters of rainfall has occurred. In SIK, in Shivamogga district at Agumbe Station, 27 centimeters of rainfall has occurred. In Goa, in North Goa, Ponda Station, 19 centimeter of rainfall is recorded. In Telangana, in Nizamabad district. Yedapalle station has recorded 17 centimeters of rainfall, and in Chhattisgarh, in Bijapur district, at Bhopal Patnam station has recorded 17 centimeters of rainfall. If we look, uh, see the location of monsoon trough at zero UTC of today, then you can see that the monsoon trough is located south of its normal position. It is currently passing through Jaisalmer, Kota, Guna, Narsimpur, Rajnandgaon, Kalimpatnam, and then it is going into Central Bay of Bengal. If you look at today's synoptic conditions, then you can see that there is a WD which is located at 72 and 32 degree uh, north. Then there is cyclonic circulation of northeast Assam. There is cyclonic circulation of Saurashtra. There is a offshore trough, offshore trough from South Gujarat to North Kerala, and there is a shear line, shear zone at 20 degree north. So under the influence of these systems, if you look at then during next five days. Uh, Extremely heavy rainfall is very likely to occur over SIK, Saurashtra, and Kutch on 17th and 18th July. Then over Konkan Goa, coastal Karnataka on 18th July, and on the remaining subsequent three days, it is expected that very heavy rainfall will continue over these areas. Monsoon will be active over South Peninsular India and their uh, 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 in uh, active over Peninsular and Central India during next four to five days. so if we look at the day one uh, rainfall forecast then here in distribution you can see that over whole western ghats central india and some parts of eastern ghats good amount of rainfall activity will be happening and over most places rainfall will be realized on uh, day one if we talk about day uh, warnings then you can see that extremely heavy rainfall warning is given for saurashtra kutch and sik and uh, red color warning is issued for them For remaining parts of Western Ghats, that is Gujarat region, Konkan Goa, CK, Madhya Maharashtra, Kerala, orange color warning with uh, heavy, rain, very heavy rainfall is issued. For Tamil Nadu also, today we have issued very heavy rainfall and orange color warning is given. Apart from this, for Telangana, West MP and East uh, Rajasthan and uh, Uttarakhand, very heavy rainfall in orange color is issued. For Central India, we have also issued yellow to orange color warning for lightning and thunderstorm related activities. If you look at day two, then in day two also the rainfall distribution will be similar to day one. That is, Western Ghats, Central India, and Eastern Ghats will be getting a good amount of rainfall at uh, almost all the places. In terms of warning, you can see that Saurashtra, Kutch, Konkan, Goa, Sik, and Sik are given a extremely heavy rainfall warning. On day two, and red color warning is issued for them. Remaining parts of Western Ghats is in uh, very heavy ra rainfall warning is given for them, and orange color alert is given. Apart from that, uh, similar to day one, West MP, East Rajasthan, Telangana, CAP, and our Tamil Nadu are also given very heavy rainfall warning and orange color alert. And Central India and Northwest India and whole Indo-Gangetic plains is given thunderstorm warning also. If we talk about day three, then here also you can see that the rainfall pattern is same. Uh, central India means whole South uh, Peninsular India and adjoining Central India will be getting rainfall at most places. Of, uh, and in terms of warning, you can see that heavy rainfall, very heavy rainfall warning is issued for whole West Coast, and all orange color warning is also issued on the East Coast. You can see that for GWB is given. yellow color warning of heavy rainfall for odisha very heavy rainfall cap very heavy and telangana now also is given very heavy rainfall and orange color alert is issued the thunderstorm activity will continue over central india and adjoining north india in on day 4 uh, the activity will be 
similar to day 3 and in addition to that northeast india will also be getting uh, uh, rainfall at most places in terms of warning you can see that whole western west coast is given yellow to orange color warning in this konkan goa ck sik and madhya maharashtra are given very heavy rainfall warning and for in terms uh, gujarat and kerala are given heavy rainfall uh, warning in terms of central india you can see that whole mp will be getting a very heavy rainfall and it is uh, uh, orange color warning issued for the uh, that in terms of eastern ghats you can see that the conditions are similar to day three and odisha cap telangana will be getting very heavy rainfall and uh, our gujarat uh, th sorry this west bengal will be getting heavy rainfall whole northeast is also under heavy rainfall warning on day four in terms of day 5 you can see that uh, you can see there is some reduction in rainfall activity over madhya maharashtra marathwada and vidarbha in terms of distribution that is fairly many places will be getting rainfall but in terms of warning you can see that uh, the very heavy rainfall warning is continuing for madhya maharashtra konkan ck sik telangana and mp on day 5 also remaining parts of central india and adjoining northwest india or north india are given heavy rainfall warning uh, associated with thunderstorm activity also for northeast india also the whole northeast will be experiencing heavy rainfall on day 5 also and in terms of eastern india you can see that uh, gwb odisha cap and jharkhand and chhattisgarh they have been given heavy rainfall warning so i thank you all for joining with us and I request you all to join us on our website and our, on our various social media platforms also where you can get the real-time information about various warnings on all India basis. Namaskar Jahind.